Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Now as you will know from last week's video, it was my birthday and I thought why not do a little video about what I got as well as what I did to celebrate. So, enjoy! So basically I just want to like make a disclaimer, I'm not trying to brag about what I got, I just wanted to share a little bit of what I did and what I got and yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below. So on the Thursday I went out for a curry at this place called Zoya with my dad um, I took a little bit of footage which will probably be on the screen now um, and yeah we went out on Thursday because um, I'd be going out with my mum on my actual birthday um, and we couldn't go out on Friday, you'll see why soon. Um, so yes, that's what we did, we went to Zoya and we ate and it was nice and it was just a nice little simple birthday celebration, myself and my dad do it every year, we go to one of my favourite places and just have food, just, just exactly what I want to do, I'm not even joking, it sounds sarcastic, I love food, okay, just love it. Then on the Friday it was my work birthday where I got given gifts and I'm going to show you now what I got. So the first thing that I got was some champagne, because I, I do, I, I love alcohol. It's so bad. Next I got some Zoella hand cream. Everyone knows that I'm obsessed with YouTube, including Zoella's little uh, beauty launch that she has. So I got the hand cream, which is from the first collection, I do believe, but I could be wrong, I'm not sure. But it is the Wonder Hand Moisturising Hand Cream, and I was like, oh my god, my nails are like messed up at the moment. I need this in my life. The next two things that I got are also related to Zoella's collections that she has and the next thing that I got I think is from the same collection so it must be the second collection but I don't know what any of them are called. Sorry, I'm so bad. I'm such a fake fan. Anyway, I got a makeup bag and it's these are a few of my favourite things. Makeup bag and I love on, on the back it says things like hot chocolate, candles, stationery, autumn, Christmas, mashed potato and these are a few of Zoella's favourite things or Zoe, which I think want to prefer her as. So I thought this was nice and I'm going um, to Spain for a hen do next weekend um, so I will probably be using this, these, I'll probably be using this as uh, my travel essential kit so yeah. The next thing I got which is the final thing from Zoe's collection it's the Zoella lifestyle collection which is honestly like my favourite collection of Zoe's ever and it is this and on it it says she designed a life she loved and inside is oh my god it's stationary heaven there's like little ASAPs, notes to self, um, big plans, which I don't have any at the moment. <laughs> my hair is like completely in my face, I do apologise. And here it says, hello, hello, so hello Monday, hello Tuesday, hello Wednesday, hello Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then in the morning these are the plans, and in the evening these are the plans. And then the highlights of the week, and big next next week's goal is what it says and I just love the colour it has marble effect and I love the orange and I love the grey pink and grey are my aesthetic by the way but um, this whole rose gold thing that she's got going on it's not even rose gold, it's copper I love that too and the last thing that I got from my work friends uh, for my birthday is this you guys are not prepared for this it's One Direction's Made in the AM vinyl record. Oh my goodness. When I saw this, I was like, oh my god, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Oh! Um, yeah, I love One Direction. I don't know if you've known that from my previous videos. Um, my makeup's not great today. Wow. Anyway, um, so yeah, so I already knew what my mum was getting me for my birthday because Deanna made me ask. And yeah, Deanna thought this would be a good idea. And it's my first record one of my presents that's coming very soon and yes just a side note thank you to all the work crew loved it so much so after work that night I decided that I would go to a rugby game with my dad it's an old time tradition oh my goodness I've just realized this is meant to be closed and it's open okay. uh, anyway so I went to a rugby game with my dad on the Friday night to watch my favorite rugby team Lee Rhinos play rugby obviously and surprisingly we won I say surprisingly it's because whenever I turn up we always lose so we won Woo! Um, yeah so then that was all I did on the Friday and it was kind of just a nice little downtime with me dad doing something that I love watching the rugby and just a fun 
day. And then it was my birthday on the Saturday. And this is what I woke up to. Now, I'd just like to make another side note that I opened the presents by myself because I'm a huge child and would not wait until like 12 o'clock when my mum finished work to open them and I just, I just didn't care. So I always end up opening presents on my own when I stay at my mum's house. Or when I'm at my dad because my dad's usually at work. So either way, I always just seem to open them by myself. It doesn't matter, I don't care. I don't, I don't, I honestly don't care. And this is what I got, so prepare yourselves. Do -do -do. I got a bottle of, I don't know how to say it, it's like Prosecco but it's not, but I drank that on my birthday, so that's gone. But here's a picture, and it, it was great, it tasted great, it wasn't as bubbly as Prosecco, which makes it ten times better. Okay, the next thing that I got was, surprise, surprise, more gym stuff. So I got, everyone thinks I'm obsessed with the gym, I don't know why. The first thing I got was this top for the gym and it's like that and it's quite see-through actually and I think these would be great for summer um, you'll see why in a second um, because it came with running pants well they're just gym pants really um, yeah and they're very nice this is the pattern um, I was a bit worried when I opened them and I was like oh I don't know if these are me but I tried them on and was like no they suit you they're fine so yeah I'm thinking these are definitely very summer and I'm very surprised that they actually fit as in lengthwise they fit perfectly and um, they fit to be the personal around this area great but on my waist these are a bit big but I liked it because it weren't like crushing me and I liked that and the third thing that I got which was a gym wise was this and it says run free and in the summer Especially when I'm in Greece, this is going to be great when I'm running, um, which is what I'm supposed to be doing now, and I'm not. Um, so what does that tell you about me? So yeah, and then the last present, well actually the second to last present was Pug Cupcakes. Again, some of them have been eaten, so I'll just insert a picture here. And anyway, they, they're delicious by the way. I don't know what flavour they are, I think the coffee, but they're gorgeous. Uh, yeah, so the last present that I got, I got a Rainbow Slayer! Oh my goodness, um, Joanne has one of these and I was very jealous and I was like, oh my god, this is like such a me thing and my mum asked me, like, I think it was a week before my birthday, like, oh, what do you want? And I was like, I kind of want um, a record player, but they're really expensive so it doesn't matter and then I got one and here are some clips of me using it because I got very excited, I had to use it straight away. I got also to my One Direction record on my brand new turntable and that's probably going to be my new backdrop by the way, just this out of this box. Then as I was cleaning this, the mess that was my bedroom floor, I noticed that I had presents that I still hadn't opened that I got given on Friday which was from my friend Danny, um, and she wouldn't let me open it until my birthday so this is what I got. First thing that I noticed was this and it says birthday girl and I did actually wear this for most of the day until I went out. I didn't want to go to the agro and everyone would just be like, is it your birthday? Let's give you a sparkler and I was like, nah. So I got a birthday girl badge which my mum said to me this morning, what do you want me to do with this? And I was like, I'm keeping it. I'm keeping it forever. <laughs> just such a neat thing. I'm such a hoarder. The next thing she got me was a body shop little uh, Set. I was gonna say scent, and it's frosted berries flavour, and it has um, body butter and shower gel. Again, all stuff I can take next week. My laptop's on. It's making noises that I didn't ask for. Anyway, so I can take this next week when I'm in Spain, which is great. I'm not vlogging that, by the way, because it's just basically. A group of girls getting drunk and you don't need to see that. Okay I have to film the rest of this quickly because the card keeps becoming full. So Danny's last gift that she got me was this really cute photo frame which says friends a nice friend is one of the nicest things you can have and one of the best friends but one of the best things you can be. From Joanne I got a necklace which has my star sign uh, constellation on it which is beautiful and I've had this for a while you will see it in Joanne's vlog um, but I haven't been able to wear it since my birthday and she also got me a mug that says B on it which 
looking at it now, it looks like a D, but it's a B. Um, and yeah, I love it. So thank you. My dad got me um, three Pandora charms, which says a B L N on it. Uh, I'll do a close up shot, but basically they're here, and then there's such lovely writing. That's why I'm not wearing it because I wanted to show you. And um, so. Thank you! And Phoebe got me a present. As you know from last week, part of my present was a video that I added to It's My Birthday. And these are what Phoebe got me. She got me um, some chokers from Primark because she knows I am obsessed with chokers at the minute. She got me a cute little tiny purse, even though she's the one with the obsession with tiny purses. I got a B handbag keyring because obviously my branding, B. Also, she got me some pegs that say to do, later, urgent, and ignore, which I thought was so me and so typical of me. And the last thing she got me was a book that says, there's always time to drink champagne and dance on the table. Now inside I thought it's just a plain notebook. Nope. She has in fact written in it. And basically it states that there are 22 things as it's my 22nd birthday that I can do and add to my bucket list, which I'm gonna do and insert a different clip because card running out and all that jazz. So yeah, I thought that was a very thoughtful gift and that's all that was given to me. After opening all my presents, I then got a massage. I was supposed to get my nails done, but since I got them done in Essex, they are completely ruined and I've only just got them off. So instead we changed it from getting my nails done to both of us having a massage, which was gorgeous by the way, and they had a dog, which was my favorite thing ever. And then that night, myself, my mum and Lee went to the Agra and we had a curry and it was amazing, basically. And that's what I did to celebrate my birthday. Those are the things I got. I hope you enjoyed this week's video and I'll be back next week with a makeup lesson doing bronzing. God help me. Bye.